Hey everyone, I'm at my uh, dad's shop today, uh, which is a bit full because before this whole quarantine thing started, he ordered enough, uh, enough material to build uh, like a dozen kitchens and like 30 sets of stairs. How many? 20 kitchens. 20 kitchens, 30 sets of stairs. But today I'm in here because I'm going to try out uh, an epoxy pour table out of uh, these pieces of walnut right here. At least I think they're walnut. We'll find out shortly. Um, and so I thought I'd join you in on this a little bit and let's see how bad I can screw this up. So I cleared myself a little bit of working area through here and my first step is going to be sanding up these edges. I'm going to take this big grinder here with the sanding wheel on it, clean up these edges a little bit. I got to get rid of any of the, the soft spots on here so that they, they don't disappear on me when I uh, do the epoxy and stuff. So like something like this, I'm going to chip it all out of there and fill it with epoxy later I think. Well, See how it goes. So I'm starting to build the form that I'm going to be both doing my pour in and uh, using it as my router sled. And so uh, I learned through watching videos that uh, heat is a big issue and so I'm building it up so we can have some airflow underneath and again we'll see how it goes. Hey, so I uh, got my boards all set up here. You can kind of see the idea of the shape. It's not really set yet, but uh, we had a lot of difficulty because these boards are quite warped. Um, and so you can see all the shims I got in through here. And this is to try and get the best sort of level as I can. And I'm going to build uh, rails on this and a slide for my router to level it the rest of the way, flip them over, do it again. Um, but that's going to have to wait till tomorrow. <laughs> 